Hello and welcome to the first episode of B-Money's Horror Review. Uh, today we'll be looking at the Mortuary of Madness 50 Movies for $20 Holy Shit Package. I picked mine up at the local Hastings here in town. Uh, it has 50 movies, most of which are shit. I'm sorry to say. But you can't really expect much when you get 50 movies for $20. There's a few that shine, however. Like the Great American Snuff Film, as you can see here at the top. Hate this camera. This movie actually got its own independent release not too long ago. It's sort of a Henry Portrait of a Serial Killer type movie. It's got that gritty documentary edge to it, and it's just following this deranged serial killer out in the middle of the desert at his buddy's trailer. Uh, another good one, Fist of the Vampire. It's pretty much a vampire fight club. It's really cheesy, got some really cheesy uh, computer graphics in it, but I kind of liked it. I don't know why. Uh, it was just colorful and creative. Another one that, well, it's not good, but I think you have to watch it just to sort of a, I don't know, a test of manhood or just to see how bad it is. Super Hell and Super Hell 2, as you can see there. Now, a friend of mine informed me that these actually have kind of a following to them. Like, on 4chan, supposedly people will banish you to super hell. And let me just tell you, uh, you don't want that. To quote the movie, I'm here to drink beers and smash queers and smoke that real skunky shit! So, check it out if you dare. Um... Let's see if there's anything else worth redeeming on here. Uh, Gothic Vampires from Hell. That's a pretty good one. Uh, not so much for the movie, but if you like goth industrial music, it has a pretty decent score. Uh, mostly done by Cleopatra Records, I think. And uh, this comes from us from Mill Creek Entertainment and Pendulum Pictures. Circa 2008. But uh, if you need a couple of days of entertainment, just, you know, some cheesy movies you can laugh at. Some of which, well, some of them really try their hardest to be a good movie. And for those, I have some kind of a respect level for. But for the most part, it's a laugh riot. Uh, if you got 20 bucks to spare, I'd recommend getting it. The Mortuary of Madness 50 Movies for $20. Pick it up at your local Hastings.